Hey folks, how are you? Joe here. I'm in the Dominican Republic. This is freaking Joe in the tropics. Never seen this before. I got a really good last minute deal on a flight and a booking here in Puerto Plata. So I took it and we're going to go do some adventures. We're going to go do some waterfalls and jump into pools and slide down rock slides. There's also a dune buggy tour through the city and a horseback riding tour through the mountains that I'm going to get done while I'm here in my short time that I do have here. This is an all new exciting adventure for me. I'm hoping that you guys are interested in seeing something like this as well. I just thought I'd give it a break from the winter humdrum uh, videos that you're seeing from all the Canadian content creators right now. So after this is done, back out into the cold, but for now, Tanned Joe. Hey folks, how are you? I'm happy to say that I've partnered with Anchor for another sponsored video. This trip that you're about to watch, I was able to leave my family for a week leave the country for a week in peace and with a good mindset knowing that they had all the amenities even if the power went out at home. As I've told you before this is the 767 powerhouse. It's LPF dependable battery has 3,000 cycles. You're gonna get a five-year warranty and a 10-year lifespan. It's the world's first GAN powered portable station. It's ultra efficient. It's durable unibody suitcase designed for enhanced portability and labor-saving tie road design. It's got smart app energy control. It's 2400 watt will charge 99.9% .9 of home or RV appliances. So not only was I able to have peace of mind with the family here, they could cook, they could turn on lights, they could have heat, they could have everything we needed in case the power goes out, which it does often here, Northern Ontario in the winter time. I can also use it for my camping, which I have done, and I have a couple spring trips in mind where I'm going to use this extensively. So right now you can save $300 off the Anchor Powerhouse 767 with code WSSPRING767. That's W-S-S-P-R-I-N-G 767. The link will be in the description below. You're standing on the computer. Come here. Come here. So thanks guys for watching this. Happy to be partnered with Anchor again, a quality product, quality company. We're on to the video. Oh my god. We're out on a tour. We're gonna go jump down some waterfalls, do some fun stuff. Cosita Rica. Cosita Rica. And the statue over there is the tour. Like Aquaman. Aquaman? The god of the sea. Right there. Ship out there. This is Taino Bay Port. Taino Bay Port. Taino Bay Port. Si. El muelle Taino Bay. Taino Bay es un muelle público. Yeah, that's real big. My brother for another mother, he's gonna be explaining you the stuff here. Okay. He's gonna be in charge to give you the information that you need from this place. Okay. He is my brother for another mother, but uh, we love him in the shop uh. anyway. Yeah, <laughs> Thank you. I think I took too many. <laughs> oh, wow. That is flavor. So, you quick break it, you're gonna look like this. Right? Oh. So it's gonna look uh, bright, and then we put in the song. It's gonna be like all like mixed with Sammy. Uh, pilon. Yeah. And this we use for smash and dupes, we call Mano de Pilon. Yeah. Now we're gonna introduce. Here, we have, we have a nice uh, woman that she's gonna present to you. She's gonna do 
Oh, dice, ok, como mamá. Vamos a poner mamá Julia primero. Y después ya la mamá Julia la dejamos. Esta la voy, esta la voy. Ok, si tú la vas. You gotta be your son. Ok, I will. Te lo voy a indicar cómo que sea. Si tú no quieres tu primero, ¿cómo vas a hacerlo? Okay, down. Yeah. Right. Uh, I'm I'm okay. I count the three. We're gonna say my hand, and you guys gonna say. Cafe. Okay. One, two, and three. Mahando. Cafe. Mahando. Cafe. Mahando. Cafe. Chan 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 chan. Chan chan chan. Okay. Now the 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 picture time. The picture time. Coffee, yeah, you're gonna smell good. Right? Wow. Mm. Are we good coffee makers? This yeah. you made this coffee. The one you're gonna have it today. So now Thank you're gonna show you how to. When it's already uh, powdered, we're gonna put in the boiling water for one minute or two. Like. Natural. Organic. With the wood. When you when you eat this kind of food in this place and the one with the wood. It's gonna have a different taste, organic oh. taste. Certainly. Very, very, very good food. Mm -hmm. And you can you can feel the difference right away when you cook with the gas and when you cook with the wood. No doubt. We call leña. Leña? Yes. Is that the type of wood? No, no. Just uh, wood. Wood. wood in Just the wood. Leña, okay. La leña. La leña. Hardwood. Very nice. What do you cooking, sir? Oh, you know, just whipping up some coffee and chocolate. No big deal. <laughs> Can you make me one fix? <laughs> one sure. fish? For sure. See. Sí. Move it, move it. Do you have a? Uh, do, do you want me to put in a thing for you? Let's go, alcoholic VIP sexy family. That's what we're having for lunch. Yeah. I'm Dominican tired. Hey, buddy. Oh, 
Oh, did I have to? Uh, yeah. So those are cocoa beans starting. This is a small one. Be careful with yourself. Oh, sorry, yeah. sorry. No, no. Is it's that? you. you oh, can... I'm, I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. Yeah. I've been around. Okay, now, if we uh, how, try to come here uh, each, I want to try to take a picture with the, with the frog. Okay. <laughs> Come in inside there. this? Uh, there is some nice message to show you over there, and this, this, this one over there. Uh, this is the pineapple. Wow. This is the pineapple. Wow. Slick. Yeah. Yeah. You see the sense he got? Very nice. But he is not ready. Of course. Yeah. Jens, uh, before Israel start giving you a whole information about the process of tobacco, I want to let you know that this is the mamawana. This is uh, what I've been talking about. Many people make mamawana in the country, but not everyone got the experience to make a very good mamawana. The sun, the most, very strong, at the same time, provides the cigar of the smell, okay? If you want a very strong cigar, you need top sleeve. Oh, okay. This cigar is not for rookies, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> you can be in trouble. Yeah. If uh, you want a mild cigar, you have to use the middle of the leaf. And if you want a Winston Churchill cigar, it's not very strong, but it's not very mild neither. You put 50-50. Ericsson, he's the man, come a little closer, we are a small group, please. He's the man on charge to mix the cigar, okay? He needs to know how much he put. And then, look, one harvest. Now we dry the leaf. Look, each when the leaf goes from green to brown, stay two months. Once the leaves are dried, begin the aging process. This has been a pretty cool tour. Our guide is very attentive and we keep getting the VIP alcoholic family treatment. So, good times. What you think is this? Can you guess? Huh? Cinnamon. Cinnamon, yeah. yeah. Oh. You are the champion, my friend. Oh, it's so bitter. It's so oh. bitter. Well, today I'm out on a dune buggy ride. I got some old Yamaha four wheelers and stuff here. Dramatic. <laughs> That's it. back up that way. It's kind of weird being here by myself, I'll tell you that.
man, this thing is a jalopy. A frickin' jalopy. Oh my god. These are thoughts from a first time Canuck outside of the freaking cold. Um, in Dominican, it's better to have dollars, I believe, American dollars than pesos. They would appreciate that more when you tip. I'm at an all-inclusive resort. That's certainly not the only way you need to go. I just didn't know anything. I didn't want to have to worry about food or anything. And I got a good deal on it last minute. But you should bring American dollars to tip. Yeah, tipping is not necessary, but it, you feel like you should once you're here. Um, they need to bring down the number, the height of the number of pesos is like 10,000 pesos is roughly $17 US. So it's like, you wanna buy something that's a hundred bucks, it's like uh, like 5,000 pesos. So that's the conversion I didn't get at first. Um, there's no prices on anything ever. And you probably shouldn't pay the first price that you hear, but I'm really, really, really horrible at negotiating. So I usually do. Um, but they're willing to, they, they set the price high, 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 and they're willing to come down quite a bit. Um, everybody's pretty nice. You don't really have a concern. I've been off the resort quite a bit, like I said. Uh, the drinks are plentiful and good, and they, they make them strong. The beers are decent. Um, the food is okay. I'm getting used to it now. They have a few restaurants, which I think would be better, but I've just been eating at the buffet type thing, because you need to, to uh, reserve those and I'm just a last minute kind of guy you can have a cigar anywhere I have been given two free boxes of cigars and about probably 15 single cigars and the Mamuana uh, national drink of this island is pretty good I had never tasted anything like it before but every single place I go to, they make me try it. And I say, oh, I've already tried it. They say, have you tried Mama Juana, brother? And I say, I already tried it. So I'm not mine, it's always different. So it's like tree bark, honey, red wine and rum fermented, I think, if I'm not mistaken. But um, yeah, everybody, everybody's chill. Everybody wants you to buy stuff. And uh, you can straight up be no and like straightforward and say no. And they won't really bother you too much after that. But if you're bad like me and have a problem saying no, they, they get you, they get you all the time. We stopped here at this local farm, having a cerveza, there's things to buy, cigars to buy. CF Motos. None of their stuff's pretty, but it all works. They move the rads to the back, the engines in the back. CF Moto.
giving people as much money as I can. It just seems like it's the right thing to do. Taking a half hour break here. There's places to get drinks so we can go swimming if we want. Then we're getting a cold <coughs> from being in the air conditioning. He's gonna like run up my arm and oh there he is. I should probably leave him alone. Eggo? Eggo. Alright. Well, oh, probably doesn't like the cigar. <laughs> hey, buddy. Hey, good boy. Good pop. I was just chilling at somebody's house right now. We're waiting for, uh, I don't know what we're waiting for, to be honest with you, but we're going on a horse ride, and I think it's just me and one guy. So, me and the guide. So, that's pretty awesome. His dog's gonna come. He's in Malinois. So, I'm excited about that. I don't know what we're waiting for. Hopefully, it comes soon. Okay. It's okay to get on? Yeah. Uh, that way? Yeah. One, two, three. Okay. 
you. That's okay. That's great. Uh -huh. Yeah, very, very good. 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 Yes, sir. Thank you. Kick him. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. Good. Good. <laughs> Let's go, good boy. Come on. Hi. Come on. Good. Salisso. Arriba, arriba, Salisso. <laughs> Sorry, what's your name? Joe. Joe. Yes. Yeah, Are you again? Josue. Yeah. Josue, yes. Yeah, Very yeah. similar. Yeah. <laughs> We're going up there? Yeah. Yeah. Good. Good. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Arriba, arriba. Andale. There you go. Yeah, good. Too. Thank you, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um lots of time and money. And pain. Oh man, thousands, thousands of dollars in like seven different times. Oh, yeah. 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 Uh, so, so beautiful. Yeah, thank you. I, I'm I feel too skinny, so I want to cover my body up with tattoos so I don't look so skinny. <laughs> my legs are next. <laughs> Good. Is it Salisa or no? Seniso. Seniso. Yes, Seniso. Yes, Seniso. Thank you. Oh. Seniso. Good horsey. Good horsey. I like it too for my mom. Yeah. And my father, I don't like. <laughs> yeah, my mom doesn't like it. Good. How is my friend? Oh yeah? Yes. I, I live in Canada. Okay. Yeah. It, it seems like a nice place to live up here. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, away from the city a little bit. What? Away from the city a little bit. Town. You're you're farther out. Oh yeah. It, it just seems less busy. Yeah. 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 Very nice. Yeah. Go. Yep. Good. First time I've ever been to a resort. First time I've ever been overseas. Uh, we're in Puerto Plata. Um, pretty awesome. I'm almost done my time here. Just finally getting able to relax. It's not my uh, first few days doing explorations and excursions. I've only been here for a few days. So.
making the most out of this. I got a good deal. So I decided let's go. We took Will on our birthday trip to Banff last month. So couldn't get a babysitter for this trip. Hence why I'm by myself. It's kind of freaking weird to be honest with you. Everybody here has people. People are like, why didn't you come with someone? It's weird. It's weird. Next time I gotta bring the kids and the family for sure. It's safe, it's fun. I didn't know what to expect, you know what I mean? And plus, no babysitter. So anyway, it's all learning experience. Joe from the Dominicana. Por favor, si sí, senor, grazie. I mean, gracias. Well, uh, uh, Tom Collins, uh, uh, Canada, US funds, Dominican pesos. Ransom guy, but there's hot dogs. In della propria I was at this spot earlier today. Today's just like a chill day. I was at this spot earlier today and there was mad, not mad cows, a lot of cows. I don't know if they were mad. A lot of cows coming this way and the security guard had to freaking run up and pet them off at the pass and throw some sticks at them and stuff. There's cow patties all over the beach as soon as you pass this freaking sign. We'll go over there in a little bit, go uh, test the waters. I've been going off resort quite a bit and it's fine. It's totally cool. Everybody's chill. The biggest thing is they just try to swindle you, like is, and I can't even blame them. Like it's not they're trying to rip you off, but I mean, it's not trying to take your stuff and go without any kind of product. They're just trying to get the most amount of money they can, and I can't blame them. Most freaking gringo whiteies here, not even knowing their language, not knowing the the conversion. You know, what I mean, they're just trying to feed their family. I get it. They freaking hustling hard. I respect the hustle. You know, I've been freaking. Uh, I've been supporting. I've been supporting. Don't don't worry about that. So anyway, this uh, this white boy is getting getting some sun here. We're gonna go swimming in the ocean. I haven't done that yet. This is the Atlantic Ocean, and I certainly have to swim in it before I leave. Salty as hell. Damn. I guess I don't know what did I expect it. Put salt water. Oh, it burns the eyes. Don't look at the GoPro underwater. Oh, it burns the eyes so bad. It burns the eyes so bad. Oh my god. <laughs> it's the saltiest thing in the world. It's so fing salty and burny. Canada. I've also found out that the, mass, the vast majority of people here are Canadian. I figure it's because Canada on a whole is colder than the US. But it's a lot of Canucks here, a lot of Montreal too.